Hi Neela, it's Grammy. And tonight's book is called Hungry Bird. Bird and his friends had just set out on a hike when Bird's tummy rumbled. I'm getting hungry, said Bird. I might need something to eat. The other animals didn't answer. They were too busy enjoying the hike. Hey, Fox, said Bird. Did you pack anything for me to eat? I'm a bit peckish. I brought some yummy berries. Would you like a few? No thanks, said Bird. Berries are not my favorite. Suit yourself, said Fox. Bird's tummy rumbled louder. Hey, Beaver, said Bird. Have you brought anything delicious to eat? I'm hungry. I have lots of nice crunchy sticks, said Beaver. Would you like some? Sticks, said Bird. Are you crazy? Birds don't eat sticks. Well, beavers do. Yum, said Beaver. Bird's legs were growing weak. Hey, sheep, said Bird. Have you packed anything tasty? I'm starving. I packed some delicious grass, said Sheep. We could share it. Grass, said Bird. I think you mean gross. Who wants to eat grass? I do, said Sheep. It's scrumptious. Bird could not go one more step. Hey, raccoon, said Bird. Please tell me you've remembered what I like to eat. I'm ravenous. I have this nice sandwich, said Raccoon. Would you like half? Sandwich, said Bird. Yuck, that sounds disgusting. It isn't, said Raccoon. It's a medley of flavors. Bird was sure he was going to pass out from hunger. Hey, rabbit, shouted Bird. Give me something to eat now. Wow, Mila, he's really hangry, isn't he? He's being very rude to his friends. How about a carrot, said Rabbit. Carrots are delicious. Carrots are orange, shouted Bird. How on earth can I eat a carrot? You crunch it, said Rabbit, like this. Crunch, crunch. Bird's tummy roared, and he collapsed on the ground. He lay where he had fallen. He lay there some more. You mean none of you packed me a snack that I like? Bird called to his friends. If I don't eat this very instant, I might die. Bird's friends had stopped to rest on a log and eat their snacks. They called to him. Bird could hardly hear them over his noisy tummy. Be quiet, tummy, whimpered Bird. I'm starving to death here. Oh, Mila, look, this picture is the same as the cover. We call that the magic page when we find the picture that's the same as the cover. Bird looked at his friends happily munching away. He was too hungry to walk. He crawled over to them. Okay, fine, I'll try your snack, said Bird. He tasted some berries. 
These taste very round. He nibbled some sticks. Crunchy. He chewed some grass. I feel like a sheep. Bird tried the sandwich. It's not as disgusting as I thought. He even ate a carrot. Hmm, not bad. It does taste orange, but I like it. Just then, Fox spotted something wriggling in the grass. Ooh, I wonder what it could be. Bird, he said, your favorite snack, a worm. No thanks, said Bird. I'm thirsty. Who brought me a drink? The end. And so the moral of the story is, when you're going on a hike, make sure you bring some yummy snacks. And if you forget, and your friends have a snack that they're willing to share with you, try it. You might like it.